so here is the other world that makes martial arts talent, Khabib Nurmagomedov, and there's so much made about his value as a corner man. Tonight, though, he is competing and has Bulas in his corner. Yeah, Coach Khabib is as undefeated as fighter Nurmagomedov compete again. This guy is the definition of pressure. He is trying to take you down, and he does not hide his intentions. He wants to get in your face, he wants to take you down, and he wants to drown you. This guy is a savage, he's a beast. Every word that describes that is Habib Nurmagomedov with a bull in his corner. Ready. Ready. Let's do it. Well, they say everybody loses in mixed martial arts. I guess everybody except the Eagle, Khabib Nurmagomedov. Impossibly difficult to get this guy off of you once he takes you down. How do you prevent that from happening is the question for the opponent tonight. Huge elbow land from the clinch. Oh, big head kick. Oh, nice right hand from the pick up the line. Nice double leg, nice finish. Well, not a guy you want on top of you. Ground and pound strikes piling up here. Good work by Nermago Meta. Gotta be careful here. All right, well, he continues to manhandle him here on the ground. Now maybe trying to get to a choke position here, DC. Nice transition. Now drops inside that closed guard, DC. Full guard. Let's see how patient he is as he attacks a submission or big ground and pop. Beautiful sequence of strikes there. Nice combination. Single collar tie now. Oh, nice jab. Leg kick check by Nermago Meta. Big double leg level change. Oh, and there's the early takedown, just what the doctor ruled. Exactly what he wanted to do. You saw it in the training footage. Takedowns are going to be the key. He got one early. He's on the right track. Drops down inside the now closed guard of his opponent. Let's see how patient he is as he attacks a submission or big ground and pound. Ooh, this could be it. That thing is tight. That arm triangle is deep. Oh, under the chin here. Could be the end. He's bridging. Oh, no way. He got out. He was able to create enough space to get his chest back flat on the mat and defend that arm triangle. Unbelievable. Two minutes have gone by. Oh, good movement to avoid that strike from the top. Well, as usual, suffocating work from the top here by Nermago Medov. And there it is, another strike gets through on the ground. All right, crowd absolutely loving it as the fighters, however compromised, make their way back to the feet. They may be tired, but that tired, that fatigue is warranted. That was a high-level grappling exchange between two phenomenal grapplers. High-velocity elbow is blocked. Oh, he does it again, takes this fight right back to the ground one more time. This is exactly what he told us on Thursday, the game plan he's executing to perfection. And he's doing it exactly as he said he hoped. Come on, Kimura, now. Oh, that Kimura looks tight. Oh, how about that transition? Right from the Kimura into the armbar. Now well, he's out, the fight's going to continue. Oh, my goodness, I thought it was over. I thought this fight was over. And very effective with the ground and pound. Well, sometimes our stat guys are stingy with the submission attempt numbers. There have been a lot of them here. Submission defense has held up every step of the way. Yeah, he's a great grappler. And he's really, really good defensively because he is so aware of all situations when he's on the ground. He has done an amazing job staying out of those submissions. Well, the ground and pound is there. And another one, another strike from the top lands for him. All right, late round action here in Khabib Nurmagomedov, as usual, having his way with another opponent, just such a nuanced game. I mean, this dude is so good at using his wrestling and grappling skills to control his opponents. He is a bear on top, and I'm saying that literally. And tonight, he is showing that his strength is on another level. His opponent looks lost. Under a minute to go. 
Oh, these leg kicks are really starting to pile up in this round as he continues to beat up that leg of his opponent. Nice job to get inside and get the single collar tie. I give one, I take one. You give one, you take one. That's how this fight is being played out. Oh, elbow inside. Beautiful ground strikes landing. Well, he continues to manhandle him here on the ground. Continuing to stay busy here on the ground. All right, has the guard closed here. So there's the end of the round, the storyline over those previous five minutes, volume takedowns, offensive wrestling. Yeah, this is an exhausting type of fight, not only for the offensive fighter, but also for the opponent. Always being under attack, always being defensive, always reacting starts to really wear at your gas tank. It's interesting to see who is more fresh going into the next round. You ready to fight? Ready. Go All right, here we go with round two. All right, well, we'll see if his opponent can make the requisite adjustments. He got taken down left and right there that previous round. It's going to be very difficult because he never got a specific type of takedown. It right. was always something different, but it always led to his opponent getting great top position. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Beautiful shot to the head from the clinch here. Kick lands flush. Namago Menov gets caught by that flush straight punch. Nice job by the offense there. Another big shot to the head. Namago Menov's in half guard now. A lot of top pressure being applied here as he works out of side control. He's got it in. guys are back and forth, but the submission defense wins this transition. This is a terrible position. Well, working pretty effectively from the top here. Nice ground and pound by Nermago Meta. We got a scramble here. Another ground and pound strike lands for this man. Nice shot there by the champ. All right, so yet another ground and pound strike lands right there, DC. He's getting very active now that he knows he can land these strikes. Well, that was a high-level extended battle on the ground. Now, though, the athletes back to their feet, and no surprise, the crowd responds in time. The crowd just loves whenever they get two high-level strikers going at it. It was very hard to get back up after getting taken down. But he's got there now. Let's see if he can take advantage of it. Great job not only reversing the position, but getting to your dominant position. Oh, right into Mount. I mean, at this point, you just have to do something. You, know, you have to maybe start trying to pull guard, grab him, pull him into you to try to change it and get him in your realm where you have the advantage. All right, working inside his opponent. Oh, and he's attacking Choke now. Oh, looks like he's got the sub locked in. the ground and pound strike. All right, well, he's got him softened up here. Just over two minutes now to go in the round. All right, this is not where you want to be. You don't want to be on your belly with your opponent on your back flattening you out. All right, bottom fighter here, maybe looking to hip escape, DC. 
Outstanding ground and pound here. Somewhat of a lost art in MMA, at least in terms of making sure that every strike counts. Not an issue for him. He's making every single one of them count. He is not pity pad. He's not touching. Every punch that lands, he wants you to feel it. Keeps going back to that jab, keeps throwing that jab, but unable to land. Both guys appeared to land there. Well, you start to really worry about the wrestling, and there's that left hand from Bobby. Underrated. I mean, it's a very underrated part of his game, his ability to stand and strike with anybody in the UFC. Side control now, DC. A lot of options at his disposal from here. Look at him attack that arm triangle on the opposite side. When it's time to finish, he will lock his hands, pass his body all the way to the opposite side, drop his... And there he is! You're winning by submission! Jeez Louise! Well, everybody in this arena still digesting this result. What a win for him tonight, and he gets it done by submission, no less. He said he was going to get it done by submission. To watch an athlete call the shot is always fun. He should be very proud. All right, so a wild round and a wild sequence there on the ground, DC. Talk us through the highlight. He's such a phenomenal grappler. I don't understand how people don't know that this guy wants to submit you. He is the best grappler, best submission specialist we've seen in a long time. We get the official decision with Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, two seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by submission due to an arm triangle choke. And still, the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Habib the Eagle Nurmagomedov. All right, so Habib Nurmagomedov had a lot of submissions late in his UFC.